Welcome to Fantastic Vision. Please subscribe us before you watch today's video. Lithography machines are the most critical chip equipment, and American companies shoulder the burden. The main reason is that China's lithography technology is lagging behind. ASML, the only company in the world that can make EUV lithography machines, can only export it domestically. EUV is an indispensable advanced equipment. Currently, only the Dutch lithography giant ASML in the world has the ability to manufacture it. However, more than 20% of the materials used in its production line are made in the United States and are subject to the export control regulations of the United States. ASML the company failed to export it domestically. The only way to break through the chip embargo in European and American countries is to liberate EUV lithography technology from foreign monopoly. To this end, research units such as the Chinese Academy of Sciences, Tsinghua University, and Peking University have successively invested in this industry, conducted independent research, and conducted some basic research. Surprisingly, ASML did not pay attention to the development of EUV lithography machines in China at all, and also dealt a blow to Chinese products, even if all the equipment was handed over to China they would not be able to manufacture EUV lithography machines. Not to mention creating replicas. Professor Wu Hanming also holds the same view. This 180-ton EUV lithography machine costs 120 million US dollars and requires more than 40 containers to be shipped. It combines American light sources and German Zeiss lenses. A series of cutting-edge technologies and parts such as Swiss CNC machining centers, with a total of more than 100,000 types, and more than 5,000 suppliers around the world, bringing together the power of the world. This is the collective wisdom of the world and cannot be accomplished by China alone. Of It can be said that compared with other devices, EUV lithography machines are much more difficult in the entire integrated circuit manufacturing process. However, after all, they are artificially manufactured. Coupled with the strong backing of the United States, the domestic semiconductor industry is also difficult. Backspace In terms of public opinion, they did not believe what the Chinese Academy of Sciences said, and no one believed them. They even issued a military order. They formed a scientific research team, for the EUV project and promised to solve this problem as quickly as possible. With the efforts of Chinese scientists, the research on EUV lithography has achieved breakthrough results, but so far, where has China's EUV lithography reached? According to CCTV News, China has basically overcome the basic scientific and technological problems currently faced by China. The first high-energy light source independently developed by the Chinese Academy of Sciences has been installed and is expected to land in orbit. At the same time, advanced equipment such as linear drawing and nanofocusing lenses independently developed by the Institute of Optoelectronics have been put into production laying a solid foundation for the realization of high-performance optical lenses independently developed by China. Currently, the three key processes of dual workstation system, light source, 
and optical lens, have broken through foreign monopoly on EUV lithography machines. This is the strength and resilience of Chinese scientific and technological workers in overcoming scientific and technological problems. You know, ultraviolet light is known as the best in the industry. It took American researchers more than 10 years to force a particle back. The difficulties can be imagined. That's why ASML dismisses ultraviolet light in China. Now it looks like he was slapped hard. Although there are still many fine parts to be overcome in EUV lithography machines, compared with its basic processes, China's manufacturing market, known as the World Factory, is much easier. Through the stumbling block of EUV lithography machines, the Ren and De Second line of China Core has been opened, and then mass production can be carried out to launch an attack on the field of high-end integrated circuits. The foreign media, which has always been known for its hindsight, gave a fair comment on this. There were once predictions that if they did not sell Chinese chips, they would only strengthen their independent research and development efforts. Now the drama has come to an end. That is the blockade that has completely changed the structure of the world's semiconductor industry. It's time to lift the curtain on this war. Now, this turmoil has come to an end, which also means that the chip ban that has changed the structure of the world's semiconductor industry is finally coming to an end. However, in fact, the impact of this chip ban is far from over. It is conceivable that after the United States manufactures EUV lithography machines, those cheap American chips will be sold on the street. By then, no one will want them. This behavior is their own fault. Although the semiconductor industry worldwide has formed a clear division of labor system, it is also an indispensable link, because the fairness of trade must be based on one's own strength and cannot rely entirely on others. Therefore, hands there is food in it to stay calm. With the vigorous development of China's semiconductor industry, the domestic production of high-tech EUV lithography machines is inevitable.